Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video we are going to talk about none other than Team Weaver. I believe that if you're working in a competitive environment or in any kind of business you came across uh, Team Weaver, even when you're on a side that helps or uh, being helped. So what it actually is? The Team Weaver is a remote desktop tool uh, with uh, the world's largest and fastest remote connection network. This is the only tool uh, you will ever need to keep up uh, with all your computers, servers and the devices at your fingertips. The only enterprise remote support tool you need uh, for industrial grade remote control, desktop sharing, online meetings, network monitoring, malware protection and uh, secure file transfer between uh, computers. They are uh, at the moment uh, located in uh, Germany and it's made for basically everybody uh, it's made for businesses freelancers and individuals as well since i'm using it to using it to help my mother uh, to solve uh, the computer issues <laughs> that she is often uh, running across you can run it in your web browser on, uh, also in on your mobile phone and uh, on or install it in your windows or mac and it's quite easy uh, to do. You can either download it or buy it. If you are a company, you would need more uh, features and more channels where you can uh, simply log in into the account and you are uh, good to go and you can help on the meeting. You can help your employees or many more people across the globe. So how it actually looks. For a single user, a remote session or business license is 29 a month. Then we go to 59 and the peak is 129.90 a month, which is actually not that bad. And yeah, you can always, uh, you can always do amazing stuff with uh, Teamweaver. So let's check it out. When you download it, uh, you'll get into this pretty nice window of uh, Team Weaver. You'll always get your ID and also the password. So if you're in a situation where you need help and you need someone remotely checking up your computer, what you do, you are going to copy paste your ID and give them your password easily if uh, the password is too hard you can just reload it and uh, yeah create new random password as you can see and then you will send this to the guy on the other side and he will be able to log into your computer remotely and work from it so that's our first option on the left side which is remote control then we have remote management we can create a meetings we have computers and contacts where you really need to sign in first then we can also chat with uh, our employees or customers and that's for business option and then augmented reality where you exactly just you know, scan the QR code then getting started and more solutions but let's make it really big so you can see what all we can do but uh, basically everything is under one roof how to connect it we are back on the TeamViewer site and when we click on download we simply have to we simply have to decide if we want like a 64-bit version or 32-bit version. 95% of you will go with 64-bit version because that's the uh, most uh, preferred bit format among the win windows. Obviously, they can all already sense uh, like if you're locked from uh, Mac or TeamViewer or <laughs> from uh, Windows, but uh, if you need to do it manually, on the top you have all the options. Mac, Linux, Chrome OS, which is an extension. 
Raspberry Pi, Android, and also iOS. So you can join uh, mainly to the chat or to the meetings. Uh, to the meetings remotely from your phone as well. If you're using it individually, there's no need of paying, it's free. But uh, since like we are already like on a business level, you really need to pay the money for it. Uh, at the moment, I can see uh, the price and you are paying like uh, per month and uh, paying annually. Here is the divided by users, one user, then multi-user or for a team. Also, you see, you can integrate it with your favorite, uh, with your favorite, uh, <laughs> with your uh, preferred uh, CRM, ServiceNow, Microsoft Teams, Freshworks or Salesforce. And yeah, easily, if you want to set up a remote, just enter ID of uh, a computer on the opposite side. So for example, I need to get in touch with exam. Mm, yeah, best example is my mother. She has some problems on her uh, computer. She's gonna give me the ID. I'll address ID in here. Then I'll go with uh, the password and I'll log in. Don't worry guys, there will be more videos covering how exactly uh, how exactly you can uh, make the bridge between, uh, between uh, two computers, but I don't really want to um, incorporate it into this video. I don't really want to make it longer, but there will be more two or three minutes videos so you can easily find it out on uh, my channel and uh, make this connection work. It's pretty seamless, easy to do, and don't worry, uh, every everyone will be able uh, will be able to do it. So yeah, that's about it. If you have any types of questions, how to download it or use it on the web browser, please feel free. And I'll explain it uh, to you and I'll create like more videos if uh, necessary. Up until that guys, thank you for watching and see you in the next one. Have a great day.